Hi guys, Mr. Rufflewuffles here. Dirt Eisendracher comes out extremely soon now, and because we can now preload the DLC, the trophies are showing up on PS4, and so I'm going to run through them all for you now. First of all, we've got something that I'm going to really struggle to pronounce because, my goodness, this is a long word. It's Der Meisterbergenschützer or something like that. Schürzer, I don't really know how you pronounce it. I'm not German. Sorry, guys. I apologize. But the achievement or trophy is in Der Eisendracher, obtain all of the ancient bones. Now, this is really interesting because in the trailer, we have seen what appears to be an ancient bow. It fires sort of like a yellow explosion type thing. It looks pretty damn cool, but I guess there are other bows as well. How many? Well, I'm guessing there will be four. I don't think that it's going to be one per character sort of thing. Like, I don't think there'll be a specific bow related to a specific character. Just like how on Origins, all of the staves were available for you to pick up. I think that in the same way here, we'll see all of the bows probably in different areas of the map and you can choose whichever one you want to use. Will they have different effects? Will they be basically a bow manifestation of the Origins staves with a charged up shot and then a regular shot? I certainly hope so. That would be extremely cool for sure. The next trophy we'll take a look at is a direct continuation on from this. It's called take a bow or take a bow and the description is in der eisendracher upgrade the wrath of the ancients now because of the title of this trophy take a bow i'm thinking that the wrath of the ancients is the bow it is the ancient bow referenced in that der meistenbergen trophy now this again sounds quite similar to the origins starves there are regular versions four regular versions no less and they are all upgradable. So I suppose we're getting another parallel to Origins here with this sort of semi-wonder weapon type thing that smashes those zombies into smithereens but can also be upgraded. Pretty damn cool stuff. The next trophy is None Left Standing. In Der Eisendrache, kill every type of zombie using a minigun. I think this is going to be quite easy. It's just a bronze trophy and it's interesting, to be honest, that it's every type of zombie that they specifically state has to be killed because we only really know about regular zombies, obviously, like walkers, and then crawlers, I guess, could be defined as another type of zombie, maybe, and then the panzer soldat, which is obviously in the trailer a couple of times. So the fact that there's maybe other zombies in the map as well is really exciting. I can't wait to see what those could possibly be. Will we see the return of the Keepers? Quite possibly, because we do have rituals in the map, we know that, so I guess Keepers need to be killed with the minigun as well, and perhaps even more zombie types after that as well. Skeletons, please, Treyarch, please do it. <laughs> That'd be so cool. All right, next trophy. Not big enough. In Der Eisendrache, trap and kill a Panzer Soldat using the Ragnarok DG4. That certainly, to me, sounds like a wonder weapon. The Ragnarok DG4, the death of the gods, this grand event in mythology. It certainly sounds like a wonder weapon in my eyes. And we're having to trap and kill a Panzer Soldat with one. With it, rather. So, what does that even mean? How exactly does one trap a zombie with a wonder weapon? Very exciting, very interesting. Is this going to be some kind of bricklaying wonder weapon that <laughs> forms a little wall and you can hold off the Panzer Soldat with it? Probably not, but I'm sure Treyarch have something damn cool up their sleeves. I can't wait to use the thing. We get some more info about it in the next trophy. Time to slam and welcome to the jam. No, I'm kidding. Time to slam. In Der Eisendracher, revive two players protected by the Ragnarok DG4. So again... Are we building walls with this damn thing? What on earth is going on? It sounds really interesting. Trapping a Panzer Soldat, reviving players protected by the Ragnarok. What on earth is going on there? I don't know. And I would love to hear your speculation in the comment section down below. Even if you have no idea, just drop some speculation in there. Just for the fun of it. All right, next trophy. Quick off your feet. In Der Eisendracher, wall by the BRM. Now, this straight away sounds just like Buried. Do you remember being able to buy an LMG in the spawn on Buried? What you had to do was run and jump, mantle onto a small platform, and buy the gun before the platform disintegrated below your feet and you plummeted towards the map below you. To me, this sounds just like that, which is super duper cool. But one thing I'll note is that in Black Ops 3, 
We have wall running now. So what if they made us wall run in a specific way in a really quite difficult area or something along those lines, somewhere where we had to be extremely quick in order to succeed, and that was the only way we could buy the BRM. I think that that would be super cool and a really interesting implementation of that mechanic, and it would just generally be a nice little challenge as well. Next up, cheeky Back to the Future reference, that is a lot of gigawatts. In Der Eisendrache, electrocute 121 zombies. Pretty straightforward, electrocute the zombies. We've seen in the trailer there are these big metal ball things that seem like they are definitely traps of some kind. They have electricity flowing around them, so I'm guessing we're going to be able to electrocute the zombies with those big metal balls. Pretty standard, fairly easy achievement. It's a Back to the Future reference. Cool. Next up, we have... Fly me to the moon. Okay, I won't sing the rest. <laughs> it's actually fling me to the moon here, and its description is in Der Eisendrache, use every wonder sphere twice. Sounds like we're going to be able to fling ourselves all over the map, just like I've said in the past with the jump pads on moon, the sort of similarities there. Very exciting, can't wait to use those bad boys. Death from above is the next trophy. In Der Eisendrache, kill a zombie while being flung by a wonder sphere. Again, very similar trophy to the previous one, except this time we have to slay some Zs while we are in the air. Should be fun to try and do. I'm just imagining myself with the upgraded ancient bow, jumping in the Wonder Sphere, getting thrown up over the map, and then sniping some zombies with it from above. That would be so cool. So, that's all of them for now. There's a hidden trophy as well, which will be the Easter Egg, but I don't know what that is just yet because it's not showing up on my system. That said, it will eventually come to light, and so I'll post a video and talk about that in due course. Thank you very much for watching my video. If you've enjoyed it, then leave a like. If you haven't, let me know why in the comment section down below, and as always, I'll see you next time. Bye!